my lovely nail divas, it's time for me to take these poly gel nails off. Um, in case you're wondering, the Yogi nail did really good. No reactions. It actually feels really good, so I'm super excited. So I'm going to go ahead and finish removing these last ones that I have. And I am going to finish up the rest of these sets, and I'm going to finish it up with the poly gel. Hmm, I just got to figure out what I did with my remover to take these tight studs off. Oh, we can use this. So I am just going to take these off. Shouldn't be really too hard to take off. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to just thin these down and I'm going to use them like a tip. That way um, I don't have to reapply as long as they still look good and not in any... Um, um, as long as they still look good, which they, they do because I literally had just done them. But I wanted to try out the Yogi poly gel. So now I'm just going to take my file and I'm just going to gently file these up. Make sure there's no lumps and bumps. That way when I go to put this poly gel on it won't be uneven. You want to do this gently though if you are um, going to be using the poly gel because it literally is super super thin. I love my Eno Couture poly gel, especially when you file it. Every time I file the Eno Couture, I just, I just love it because it smells so good. All right, so it did try to lift a little bit right there. But that's okay, because we're gonna fix it. All right. So I do have some isopropyl alcohol here that I am gonna use with, or no, actually I take that back. I always forget that. I do this every time. I'm actually gonna use the your Yogi slip solution.
worked um, great. I was really shocked with it. And so, yeah, very happy with it. Anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Make sure to hit that like button down below, guys. Go ahead and subscribe because it's totally free. Why not? And I just want to say thank you, guys. I love you all. And have a good night. Bye.